right, I'm here to show how the mid-goal mechanism works. If you look at this, these act as our liners and our stoppers, which is pretty cool. I'm gonna show that in action real quick. So it goes there. That, see, it just aligned back to perfect spacing. Move up a bit, and then you're good. It's perfect, just how it works. All right, just to show you again, I'll realign it with more of that. All right, there you go. That's perfect. All right, to talk more about the mid goal, we're gonna talk about some limitations of it. So first, the drivability of it. Um, for me, it took about an hour to learn how to align it properly while driving in like full speed. But once you get it, you get really used to it. It's not that hard, but it's just that in between matches, you have to be able to do it as quick as you can with pressure and like with time limits, right? Um, another limitation is the hood. You have to be able to tune your hood a lot. Right now, our hood is in tune, so sometimes I'll like put a clip in it somewhere that uh, the disc will actually fly up above it, but with the proper hood, it would actually stay on and push the disc more in. But if you can get those, thing, those two things down, I think this mech would be really good.